All right, Rick Brewing, NKYSportsBlog.com, here with Eddie Eviston, head coach of the Newport Central Catholic Thoroughbreds. Coach, you, you've played in this event before. What's it sort of do at the beginning of the season? Does it give you sort of a playoff atmosphere right out of the gate? You know, it does. Obviously, you know, everybody's so excited. Just like the same thing you would get in a, in a playoffs, you know. Um, a lot of people come out. Um, you know, they're geared up to start the season. So it's a great atmosphere. You know, our kids love it. It gives them a good experience. Um, you know, several years we've been, you know, able to play at Nippert Stadium, which, you know, gives you that big venue. You know, this year we're playing at Dixie, which, you know, you expect the crowd to be um, enormous. So, you know, I think it's going to be uh, – it's just a good experience. seems like every year you guys are pl really stepping up your level of competition in this and playing a bigger school like at Dixie this year. I know you played them last year as well. What's that sort of do to play that top competition before, like Coach Kyle's talking, about you get into that two-way play exactly you know we you try to challenge yourself um, early um, kind of answer some questions um, see who, what, got, what some of your guys are that what they can handle and what they can't so um, we, we prided ourselves on always uh, playing stiff competition uh, playing the bigger schools seeing where we stand and um, you know as you know as we play those uh, play that schedule it does it gears us up for our for our district play and um, you know, and, and again, sees where we stand as we, uh, you know, try to get into the playoffs. You mentioned uh, question marks, questions to answer. Obviously, you've got a big one. There's not going to be a Brady Hachu in your backfield this year. First time in a long time at Newcath. How are you going to replace a guy like that? Yeah, you know, y'all don't think you ever try to replace a guy like that. It's just a matter of guys just filling in and uh, taking over the, uh, you know, that role. And uh, obviously, Brady was did a tremendous job. He was our quarterback for three years and did uh, remarkable things. Um, but we're excited about the guys we have. Uh, they're going to compete for that job. Um, you know, some of it might be they might bring a little something different to the table than what Brady did. Um, you know, so it'll be interesting to see. And uh, we're excited about that. We're excited about the guys we have returning, the guys that, uh, you know, are at other positions. And, um, you know, it'll be interesting to see what happens. But, you know, I think everyone, you know, it's safe to say we're, gonna, we're still going to play new calf football. And, uh, you know, we hope to uh, get after it and, uh, you know, do what we can. And finally, just talk about the rivalry with Holy Cross a little bit. It seems like it's build, it's been building every year, but now that they finally have you know knocked you off one time in the playoffs, do you sense a hunger from your guys to sort of get back at them and, and make that a real rivalry? Of course, you know I, I think these, a lot of these kids, obviously the ones who you know are returning, you know they know you know that Holy Cross knocked us off. So of course, you know they 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 I'm sure they marked that you know on their calendars and uh, you know and I'm sure. Uh, you know, Holy Cross has marked the, our game, and it is. It's a, it's becoming a big deal, and um, you know they did uh, a great job last year, well deserved, and and what they did, and uh, so we're excited. You know, we're excited. To, you know, we got a great great team in our district, and we'll get after it. All right, that's head coach Eddie Eviston from the Newport Central Catholic Thoroughbreds. I'm Rick Brewing, NKYSportsBlog.com.